by buying that bag of marijuana, by buying that line of cocaine at the bar, because you just want to have fun, you're supporting the whole machine. And that's the problem that people don't understand. We want to treat them and do treat them just like we treat everybody else for the most part. Um, there's no favors given or anything like that. If they, if they step out of line, they get dealt with just like anybody else. Uh, we have a local chapter now that's fairly new. So we're fully aware of who these, these individuals are. Well, the no color ban is, uh, is, is a choice. I mean, the public are intimidated by, uh, by the patch wearing members. And uh, it must affect business, uh, the business community, uh, and even the downtown core. Um, maybe you might see less people in the downtown core enjoying what they would normally enjoy on a normal weekend. Um, a lot of people shy away from wanting to have any type of contact with these people because they are they do feel they do feel threatened and the business community has voiced that fact as well um, but they're not saying no don't go into the bars they're saying we don't want the colors in the bars we uh, uh, we'll accept you without your colors, so if you take your colors off, you're welcome to, you're welcome in our establishment, but not as a color, uh, not wearing colors, because that's intimidating to patrons. When you talk organized crime, one way that they can project power is through intimidation. Intimidation and violence. And while the violence won't happen all the time, what happens is is that others in within the criminal organization and within the public begin then to associate begin to then associate the violence with the group so that then the intimidation can take over so that now you don't may not you may not necessarily have to project that violence all the time but just people knowing that it could happen allows you to project your power I think we pretty much consider them all equals, uh, but the, you know, the hang around probably is a little more aggressive uh, and open about the, the aggressiveness. I mean, they, they do have a little bit more to prove to become a, a member of the club, but uh, for the most part, we treat them equal. I don't think any one is any more or less dangerous than the other. I liken it a little bit to playing hockey. Uh, one team has to play by the rules, and uh, the other team is allowed to play by whatever rules they want.